How's it going, everybody? Welcome back. And today I'm showing you guys a little tutorial for Nord's extension, Chrome extension here, which is super simple to use. It, this is going to be a very short video. Obviously, you're not going to find all the uh, bells and whistles and, and kind of uh, all these options that you find in the application itself. But I do recommend looking into the application because if you're going to be buying a Nord subscription, then I would just recommend using the application itself rather than the Chrome extension. But if you're like on, uh, if you can't for some reason download the application, uh, the Chrome extension is super easy to use. So once you download it, you're going to go to your extensions tab right here, click on it, and you're going to uh, find this page uh, where you can connect, quick connect, you can search for a country. And uh, yeah, it, it really is as simple as that. So uh, if you go to the settings here, uh, there's nothing complicated about it. You have the block RTC, web RTC, which will prevent your IP address from leaking. Uh, you have CyberSec, which is an ad blocker, an ad and malware blocker. I would also recommend combining it with one of the ad blockers. I have uBlock and ad blocker. And, uh, you know, combining all those together will make sure that you don't get any uh, ads. Another thing is bypass list, which is kind of like split tunneling, except it only lets you choose which websites you'd like to bypass. So let's say I want to use the Chrome extension, but I want YouTube to not get affected by the uh, VPN, by NordVPN's uh, kind of tunneling here. So once I choose that, if I go to, let's say, okay, quick connect and It'll connect me in just, okay, oh, it's already connected. So now I'm sure that um, YouTube won't actually be affected by my, uh, by, by NordVPN because here, if I go, then that'll be it. So that's really all there is to it when it comes to NordVPN. Uh, personally, I'm not a big fan of Chrome extensions. I mean, if I'm going to purchase a NordVPN subscription, then I'd rather just use the uh, application itself. Uh, you'll get way more benefits with the application. You get um, uh, definitely better security, 100% more security, better encryption, more options in general, actual split tunneling. If you're interested in kind of finding all about the features and, 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 and benefits of NordVPN, I'll leave a link in the description down below for the in-depth review. I look into the privacy policy, speed, uh, torrenting and streaming capabilities, as well as security and features. So be sure to check that out. I'll leave it in the description and you'll find you'll also find the links to special deals and discounts as well. So um, yeah, you'll be able to save yourself a few bucks if you're interested in that. So thank you very much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one.